Richard Atkinson headed the University of Wisconsin lab that discovered the so-called fat virus in chickens. They then found antibodies from the virus in 30% of obese people, but only 11% of lean people. While there's no proof yet that the virus causes human obesity, Atkinson was convinced enough by animal studies to start a company to test for the virus. 100% of monkeys, which is the closest uh, model that we have to humans, 100% of the monkeys got fat. So if you've got, a, if you are infected with this virus, it's a human virus, you are almost certainly going to get fat. Atkinson says finding out if they are positive for the virus could make obese people feel better about themselves and warn lean people to seek treatment. I think ideally it, it, everybody in the country should have a test once a year. But Randy Seeley, associate director of the University of Cincinnati's Obesity Research Center, disagrees. And not just because many obese people are negative for the virus. At this time, we simply do not have any of that kind of information to say, you know what, if you test positively, you should go for this treatment strategy, not this treatment strategy. He points out that there is currently no approved medical treatment for preventing obesity and says we're all at risk. The reality is we all have every reason to be taking our diet seriously, taking our exercise seriously, whether or not we test positive for this virus. Seeley says for now, the idea of an obesity virus remains just one of many ideas worthy of further research. I'm Brad Closa.